Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Uh, today we'll we will discuss a very important topic. Try to give two differential diagnoses in both long case and short case. Only tell the third differential diagnosis when the examiner asks you to tell the other differential diagnosis. The benefit of telling only two differential diagnoses is that examiner will be impressed and he will think that the candidate is confident on his differential diagnosis. But if you tell more than two differential diagnoses, the examiner will think that you you are not confident on your differential diagnosis and so you are giving more than two differential diagnoses and so it will put a very bad impression on examiner you can also tell in this way that uh, my provisional uh, diagnosis for this patient is stroke and my differential diagnosis is dural sinus thrombosis if the examiner asks you what is the third differential diagnosis so you can answer that uh, my third differential diagnosis is subarachnoid hemorrhage so only give the two differential diagnosis and the third one only when the examiner asks you to tell. Uh, in the tabli point we will discuss that uh, if you are doing clinic or second job you will never get time for your kids, your wife and yourself. So uh, just uh, look at the other people who are uh, doing clinic and you will come to know that uh, they have uh, no time for themselves and their wife or their kids.